Teacher Jeff, and today I wanted to work on some keyboarding activities. The one that we're going to do is on a website called kidstype.com. Kids with uh, a Z instead of the S. Anyway, I like the site for a number of reasons. It's fun. It's definitely free, and you don't even have to create an account or anything like that. Um, so we'll go through some of my favorite games on there. The things I don't necessarily like about the site is that you can't maximize the window, so it's a bit small. The way around that is to use the zoom function on your keyboard. If you're using an Apple keyboard, the zoom function is command plus. If you make it a little bit too big and you need to go back a little bit, to normal it's command minus so command plus to zoom um, another thing I'm not crazy about the website is that the games can be a little bit fast meaning if you don't um, complete the task quick enough um, the game will just be over and you have to start over so the ones that I picked are a little bit better they're a little bit slower more for beginning typing and let's go through some of them. I'm at the kidstype.com website and this is the home page. As you can see it has some games, lessons, exercises, different ways to practice typing. So let's go to the games and double click it. All the different games are here. The one that I like to start with is Cute Jumper. And the thing I don't like is that this is as big as the window gets. No way to, real, to really maximize it. So let's use Command Plus if you're using Apple Keyboard. That's about as big as we're going to be able to make it and still be able to see everything. Um, so this one, you're just basically matching the letters they're asking for. If you take too long, this little floating thing um, we'll go down and it'll be counted as a mistake. So you have to kind of go a little bit quickly. Um, and also if you start making mistakes with the keyboarding, it'll also, you'll get an out. So it's a game, it's not just practice. So let's try it. Pick a character, you can pick any of these. And here we go. So they're asking you to do G, J, and F. All right, he's hopping to the next one and now it's floating so you gotta go a little faster. J, F. H, S, F. DJJ. Let's make a mistake. So, don't want to make too many mistakes. And then it's floating down if I'm not going fast enough, and the game's over. So, a little bit challenging, but um, it's a nice little game. So, as far as another one I like, it's probably easier actually than that one. It's called um, Type Rocket. So you can make it a little bigger. Yeah. Same type of stuff. You're basically matching the letters that are rising with the rockets. And here we go with the Y. And you get some fireworks. P. Let's do the W. S. This one is really just on a timer. And it's just counting how many you, you match, how many you miss. So this one's good. It's kind of 
feel like this one's a little easier than the last one. B, semicolon, Q. seconds. All right, so now it's saying that we pop 19. I didn't miss any and my score is 190. But you could challenge yourself to see how many you can get if you can get a higher score. Let's find out what other games there are in here. So this one I also like, it's called Glider Cats. Glider Cats Words. Let's just start playing and see what happens. They're gonna want you to enter your name. Pick a character. Let's just start with three letters. And it looks like it's a bit of a race, so I'm the yellow mask, and let's, let's um, match M, E, W, and that made him go a little faster, S, I, N. See if I can catch up by going faster. Challenging because they're all they're already faster than me. Looks like getting towards the end. Okay, so I came in last place, but it's okay, you can try again. Go back to games. So the last one we're going to do is called Bull Spell. And I believe this one is pretty much the same as the last one. So it's a race. I'm the blue one. Let's see if I can get ahead. Give me some words. Made a mistake. I was trying to go too fast. I'm not going to catch up to them, so I'll just go a little slower anyway. Whether or not you win the race or not, it's still kind of good practice. you back to this page I don't like as much because it's more like drills so if you want to explore more games just keep going to the games tab and you can check other ones I felt like those were the best ones on this page but I didn't spend too much time looking at other ones I just noticed that some of them were kind of fast that's kidstype.com Hope you enjoy doing some typing games.